Hello everyone, happy to see you here and welcome back to my channel Brain Logic. Really interesting question today, a lot of students do this mistake and I wanted to record this video. So as you can see we have a very simple expression, we have 9 divided by 3 divided by 9 divided by 3. So on the first side you can easily solve it because you learned this stuff in the third grade so you can easily check your, your brain level, your algebra skill right here and I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. It will be really interesting for us to check our answers. Right here we have 4 options, it's really great because you can choose one option, what do you think is the correct answer? And I, I swear you will be shocked about the correct answer, because a lot of students do this mistake and I wanted to record this video. Okay, first of all, I want to start with this solution. So we have 9 divided by 3, I wanted to read this question, 9 divided by 3, divided by 9 and divided by 3. So here's our question right here and I want to start with this solution. So one part of students solve it like that, mostly students solve this question like that, this is the most common solution I have ever seen. First of all, they start from the left hand side. We have 9 divided by 3 equal to equal to 3. Okay, equal to 3. And they say that 9 divided by 3 on the right hand side, this is the same as right here, so we can easily jump from left to right, and right here we will have the same 3. So it looks like 3 and with this division, so 3 divided by 3 equal to 1. So this is the most popular solution I've ever seen and right now I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect. I want you to understand that in math we need to know what is the correct order to do this problem because obviously whatever order of operation we select is going to create a different answer, right? So we need to understand what we need to start with. We should start from this division, we will have one answer from this division on the right hand side, another answer and a lot of combination we can jump right here but we will have the different answer all the time. But in math we're interested only in one correct answer. So let's separate this uh, solution right here. I don't want to tell that this is correct or incorrect, this is like the most popular solution I have ever seen. But right now let's try to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. And for this question I have this PMDMC order of operation, this is the most popular order of operation in the world, all internet libraries, scientific graphing calculator works according to PMDMC. And let's solve this question according to correct order of operation, not as re like right here, we just jump from left to right. Maybe this is correct or not correct, I don't know exactly, but let's solve this question according to DMC. So I want to rewrite it, so we have 9 divided by 3, divided by 9 and divided by 3. Okay, okay. So, PMDMC works from the top to the bottom right here and let's go through the steps. First step, parentheses. Okay, let's look at it. Where do we have this parentheses? I don't see any parentheses, we don't have any parentheses, so we just we just skip this part, which is which is really great for us. Because with parentheses this question like will be more complicated, we don't have any parentheses, so we just we just skip this part. Okay, what about exponents? Let's look at it. As I told before, we don't have any exponents and we can easily skip this part with exponent. For example, uh, imagine you have like 3 to the 10th power, you need to raise this, it's like um, take a lot of times right here. So we, ju we don't have this exponent and parentheses part, which is, which is really great. Okay, let's go to the next step. Multiplication and division group. A lot of students do this mistake, they say okay, multiplication, but multiplication and division group. We need to add to this multiplication division, so this is one common group. And right now we need to scan where do we have this multiplication and division signs. Let's look at it. Uh, I don't, I didn't see any multiplication sign, but we still have division sign. Right here we have division sign, so we need this expression. Right here we have division sign, so we also need this expression. And right here we have division sign. So our our question is about this division case, division case. So we don't have multiplication sign, but we have division sign. This is really great. And same in other words, we didn't have any multi, any addition and subtraction sign. So we didn't have any addition and subtraction sign. So we have only this division group. Yeah, we didn't have any addition division addition and subtraction sign, we have division only, only division. But what is the correct order? So can we jump from, from left to right right here? And what, is, what tells us PMDMC? How can we solve this correctly according to PMDMC? According to PMDMC you need to look at it, what is the first sign from left to right? So the first order is from left to right, according to PMDMC, this is from, from left to right order, but what about a uh, correct uh, order of the division sign? What is the first d division sign we need to do? So the first division sign is from left to right, is this one, so we need to scan what the first sign from left to right. So the first sign from left to right, we have three signs, this is like, it looks like in the middle, this is on the right hand side, this is on the left hand side, so the first sign from left to right we need to start with. So we have 9 divided by 3 equal to, equal to 3, so we need to start from this from this division, which is really important. And we still have this expression, so 9 divided by 9 and divided by 3. Okay? What are we going to do next? The same thing. 
PMDMC works right here as well. We have we have this expression with division all the time. And what is the first sign from left to right? The first sign from left to right is this division right here. So we need to divide 3 divided by 9. It's really great step right here because 3 divided by 9 equal to... I write it in a fraction way. I hope you will understand my, my explanation right here. So it is, this is like 3 over 9 which is equal to 1 over 3. Okay, we have this division right here. So 1 over 3 divided by 3. This is like a regular division right here. So we can easily divide it equal to 1 over over 9. Completely different, yeah? 1 over 9 and 1 right here. So we can easily say that this is absolutely wrong solution. Because we cannot jump from left to right. And maybe if you put brackets right here, we will have a correct answer. Yeah, if you leave with brackets, parentheses, we need to start from this parentheses. Division right here, 3. Division right here, 3. And 1 is a correct answer if we, if we have parentheses. Right here we don't have parentheses, so we reject this option A. This is not option B, obviously, because 1 over 9. This is not option C, because this is 9. But what about this D, 3 to the power minus 2? Let's look at it. 3 to the power minus 2, this is, looks like 1 over 3 square, like a fraction. So we will have the same answer as right here. So 3 to the power minus 2, this is the same as 1 over 9. Yeah. So saying in other words, this is absolutely wrong solution. This is the most common mistake I've ever seen. But this is a very bad solution. So just forget about it. This is not option B, this is not option C, and 1 over 9, this is option option D. So a correct answer, this is, I write it here, our answer, our answer, this is option D is a correct answer. But according to PMDMC, a correct answer is 1 over over 9. According to this test, correct answer is option D. So we hope you understand my explanation. If you still have any question, write a question into the comment section. I wish you all the best in your mathematics adventures. Thank you for your time and have a great day. See you in the next videos.